Las Vegas Sun UNLV football beat writer Ryan Green joins us now to enlighten us with his expertise. Ryan, we just heard Coach Sanford talking about it. What is the updated status on Rebel running backs? Well, Killer, it looks right now like the number one guy is going to be Channing Trotter. Uh, of course, it's subject to change, but C.J. Cox's hamstring has been re-aggravated twice now in fall camp, and it looks like standout freshman Bradley Randall is going to be brought along pretty slowly. Uh, the Trotter, a junior, he's shown the most drive and hunger for the position so far in the fall camp, and at this point, he, he, frankly, he deserves a starting job. A tough kid who the Rebel fans are really going to admire. Uh, however, don't be surprised to see this continue to be a position by committee. We'll hear more from Green later in the show, but to read more on his take on the backfield, head over to LasVegasSun.com slash Rebels. Let's bring back Ryan Green from the Las Vegas Sun. And Ryan, who's the X Factor on defense this year? Well, right now it looking, it's looking like junior linebacker Ronnie Paulo uh, with Jason Bochamp and Malo Tamua working at DN and about 650 pounds worth of D tackle in front of him. The Western high product, he's got a chance to do some serious damage. He's the biggest hitter on the Rebels defense, uh, but last year the key was health. Uh, he had a right ankle and knee injury that bugged him all year, and he was playing at about 75% for most of it. At full strength, uh, he's a pretty scary dude. Thanks, Ryan. And LasVegasSun.com slash Rebels is your source for more on the UNLV defense. That's online at LasVegasSun.com slash Rebels. More fun time with Ryan Green of the Las Vegas Sun. It's time for predictions. Last year, R5, you said UNLV would go 6-6 six and, six and upset TCU. They finished 5-7 and seven and almost beat TCU, losing 44-14. to 14. You almost had that one, only five touchdowns off. What up for this year? Well, A9, I'm going 6-6 six and six for now. Uh, I say that because after watching fall camp, this team's obviously improved on defense and is still very dangerous on offense. But that's fall camp. You don't know anything until the game time comes. Uh, personnel improvements, though, warrant a one-game improvement prediction from last year. As for an upset special, I'm saying right now, October 17th, homecoming, Utah comes to town, book it. Never one to back down, Ryan Green, everyone. And to get more on UNLV leading up to next week's season opener, log on to LasVegasSun.com slash Rebels.